here are three books that really inspire me as a writer and they're also enjoyable to read. So the first one that I read a, about a year and a half ago is Body Full of Stars by Molly Carol May. She's a local author here in Montana and she writes about female rage and her passage into motherhood and she's just so wonderful at describing her emotions and the scenes around her which are all incredible set in, set in the Montana landscapes. But I just really admire the way she can pull you into a scene and if you're exploring postpartum or motherhood in general it can be a really healing read. It was for me. I originally was a little nervous about the title saying female rage however I've even had friends that haven't had children read it and they really connected with some of the themes that she covers that are very relevant to females and mothers in general. So then I picked up this book last year. It's called Little Fires Everywhere. I'd heard about it a couple times. And this book, it's the title says Little Fires Everywhere and it is like a fire. Like I picked it up and I could not put it down almost to the point that I was in a panic because I was like, I have to know what's gonna happen next. I have to know what's gonna happen next. This author just really pulls you right around, with the, right along with the story. And it really, it explores issues that are very relevant to our times regarding different socioeconomic classes. It pulls in a single mom and her daughter and then a, upper class family and the issues that this book covers are just phenomenal. I think it's actually, yeah, it's a Hulu series now. So this is a fast and furious read um, if you're into that. This book, Where the Crawdads Sing by Delia Owens, I'd heard about it a couple times, but it was one of those books that was just on my list for a while and I finally got, got it and it was a little slow to start for me, but the story is written so beautifully the way this author describes the scenes is it's just so delicious. Um, it's a book about a little girl who's abandoned by her family and grows up in a marsh and Delia Owens has a lot of history with nature and you can really see it and feel it when you read this book so I obviously like books that pair an emotional story with nature um, since I liked Body Full of Stars too. And I have two bonuses to show you real quick. I uh, I just love Elizabeth Gilbert's work and I especially love what she's doing now. She's lifting up um, black female authors on her Instagram. But anyway, uh, her Eat, Pray, Love book is always, it's just such a good read. It's got so much spirituality in it. And this book that she wrote is uh, City Full of Girls, just a really fun, read about a showgirl that I enjoyed and I just love her writing. It's real easy to to read and enjoy. So I hope that you found something here that you might like. Please comment and let me know if you've read one of these. I'd love to hear what you liked or didn't like about it. And if this video was helpful, please share it.